throughout this songwriting part of the course, uh, there's gonna be some stuff that's gonna be geared towards absolute beginners, intermediate players, and advanced players. This part is for the absolute beginners. Like, you don't know that what the world can be with you as a guitar player. And I'm here to show you that right now, within a matter of minutes, that you can be a songwriter. Um, so we'll start like this. So if you're holding a guitar in your hands and you can play a couple of notes on the guitar, you're well on your way to being a songwriter. You don't even need to know the names of the strings. For the moment, let's just call it the fattest string, the one closest to you. It happens to be the E string, but play that string. Great job. Okay, so that, so, and then pick any of the Pick a dot, so the first, second, or third. Let's take the first dot, just for the, for the sake of argument. Um, and so all you're gonna do is play those two notes, one at a time. And now the dot. Okay. Practice that so you're able to play both of those. Now just pick a number between one and four. Let's just say four is the number that you chose. Play that fat open string four times in a row. Pretty good, try it again. Sounds like the fat open note four times in a row. Now that second note, which is this dot here, how about let's pick another, another number two. All right, so we're gonna play that twice in a row. One more time. Now let's put it all together. The fat note four times, the dot two times. Now repeat. I, we just wrote a song. On your own guitar, pick any notes, any dots, any numbers, play them in a consecutive order and repeat, and then you're a songwriter. There's no mysterious mystique. You and Paul McCartney are now songwriters, okay? There's a, there's a longer route to writing Let It Be, but there's no, no difference between you as a person who can hold a pick and have a guitar in your hand to become a songwriter right now, today. The same thing applies with playing simple chords. If you can learn, like I've got a six-year-old kid at home, and the other day I was like, I'm gonna teach you how to write a song. He said, Dad, that's impossible. I said, no, it's not. We did the same principle. He just held his finger right here. It's an E minor seventh chord, but you don't need to know that. Just hold your finger right there and strum all the strings. And now put that finger on the dot on the fattest string. For the sake of argument, let's do our four strums on the first one, two strums on the second one. Let's speed it up and see if it sounds like punk rock. And you're a songwriter. Songwriters are just people that put notes and chords in a certain order and play them a certain number of times. There's nothing more to it than that. I discovered that in my basement with my punk rock band and the heavens opened. All of a sudden, I wanted to play guitar because I didn't have to wait. I didn't have to laboriously slog through a tar pit of tiresome lessons. I wasn't working the guitar. I was immediately playing the guitar. And so now you can play the guitar too and write some songs.